Hi, in this video I'll explain a solved problem on concave mirror. We have certain details given, the focal length of the mirror, the height of an object and where it is placed on the principal axis and we have to find out where the image will be formed, what will be the height of the image and how much it will be magnified or diminished as compared to the object that we are starting with. So let's draw the ray diagram and we have to be careful that we draw the right one. I mean that the position of the object must be carefully put on the ray diagram. So you can see that here the red arrow should be at 20 centimeters from point O. It means it must be farther away from C. The point F is focal length which is at 5 centimeters. So the point C should be at 10 centimeters from O and therefore the red arrow, the object, should be at 20 centimeters from O. So even if we draw the ray diagram roughly, we will get the image position correctly. And we can find that the image is formed between F and C, it's real and diminished. This is a good way to check if our answer is correct. Now we plug in the values into the ray diagram. We have plugged in U is equal to 20, as you can see. The image distance V is to be found. The height of the object is put as 4. And the focal length O to F is put down as 5. Now we go forward and apply the equation. So the mirror equation is 1 by V plus 1 by U equal to 1 by F. And we know U, we know F, so we can find out V as 6.67 centimeters. This is the distance from the origin point O. We can be happy with this result because it matches with the ray diagram. The image is farther away from F, F was 5, but it is less than C, C was 10. So it should be a correct answer. The linear magnification is minus V by U, so that comes out as minus 0.33. We can also be happy with this because it shows that the image is smaller than the object. The minus sign is because the image is inverted. Now, we want to get the height of the image. The magnification is nothing but image size by object size. That's height of image by height of object in general. So, minus 0.33 is equal to height of image by 4. Therefore, the height of image works out as minus 1.32 centimeters. So our answer is matching the ray diagram and we can be happy with that. I hope this was useful. Thanks and have a great day.